walking past this stand, Bodor, the first thing that stands out is the actual machine themselves. Now, you've won some design awards in Germany for these machines? Yes, for the, uh, they call it the Oscar in the design oh. industry. Red Dot, yes. So you have the Oscar on your mantle at home. <laughs> <laughs> Engineers will want to know about the machine. I mean, it's a fan it is a fantastic looking machine, but the machine itself. Well, first of all, what size is the envelope? For this one, it's with 3,000 by 1,500 millimeter, the working area. Yep. And uh, with uh, the exchange platform, the whole size is around 9 millimeter. Okay. Yes. But uh, you can do bigger machines? It's not the biggest one. The biggest we can one. now do the biggest one, it's uh, 8 meter by 2.5 meter. Right. So yes. That's a, a big machine. Yes. Now, I'm thinking if you've got machines that size, these are twin pallets, so you can. Change. change for yes, they can change at the, the fast the fastest is around fifteen seconds, and this one just ten seconds. Ten seconds. Yes, ten seconds for oh. exchange, but for that one would be fifty okay. seconds. So but both fast. exceptionally fast. Yes. Okay. Now the, the actual laser itself, I mean, it's key to these machines is how fast they cut. What? How powerful is this laser, and what type of laser is it? For this one, it's with a six kilowatt, yep. and uh, the maximum speed we cut. For example, this one with a one millimeter stainless steel, we cut around the speed five millimeter, five hundred millimeter per minute. Yes. And but this is this is a six kilowatt laser. What's yes. the what's the most powerful laser you have? We now have thirty kilowatt. It's a, a similar machine with this one, yep. but uh, much stronger than this one. Okay. This machine we call it a S series, which means super. Yep. Start from six kilowatt. Now, having a more powerful a laser, yeah. I'm thinking it's going to cut thicker depth. That's not the reason you have a more powerful laser. Is that correct? Um, high power laser is uh, much stronger, but it's not so common use. In most of them, they, they cut some thick material for the shipment or right. other stuff. Yes. Okay. Now, what sort of thickness of material will these, these machines cut? For this one with six kilowatt, you can cut. Uh, you can cut carbon steel, 25 millimeter. Maximum, okay. yes. And standard steel, maximum 25 millimeter. Also, aluminum, 25 millimeter. Yes. So basically, any metal. Yes. Uh, most of this uh, uh, metal, they can absorb the heat from the laser, so we can cut it. It's okay. Now I'm thinking as well, using this machine, the control system is it easy to program, easy to use? Yes, of course. It's for this one, you can s this one with a uh, 32 inch touch screen here. You can input all this uh, here. You can maybe. You can choose all these okay. joints with DXF or DWG or, or, or NCE, the, the pro format. And okay. just choose here. Here is a demo for the right. yes for the joints. And you can choose one. Maybe we can choose another one here. Then you can just uh, select it and uh, find to so set the parameters here. Then you can choose how to cut with how, how power you want to use and uh, how about the speed. Okay. So easy adjust to adjust the actual power yeah, of the of laser. Course. Now, the actual machine, it's in, in terms of moving around the envelope, what are the rapids on this machine? How fast will it move? How f the maximum for this one is uh, 140 meter per minute for the oh, yeah. X sizes and the Y sizes. Okay, and then finally, I mean, you had a nice little uh, pro uh, program on there. What accuracy will this machine go to? Uh, the accuracy for this one is 0 0.05, okay. and the re-precision accuracy is uh, 0 0.03. Right. So I'm taking from all of you said there, yes. the machine, Extremely fast, yes. extremely accurate, extremely powerful. Yes, okay. and uh, extremely quite good looking. <laughs> and to top it off, a fantastic looking machine. Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.